What's up everyone? Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Before we begin, make sure to hit the like and subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon. We're posting four videos every day, so make sure to check back every single day. We've just hit 20k subscribers, so thank you all so, so much. Let's get to 30k and get a deal in the description if you haven't already. Plenty of free crypto and goodies down there. This is not financial advice. Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Let's begin. What's up guys, so just before we begin, make sure to hit the subscribe and the bell icon. People aren't seeing our content and this is probably because you haven't hit the bell icon. Thank you again for all your support. The algorithm is slamming a lot of content creators right now, so we really appreciate all your support. And we're so proud of the amazing community that we've built. So make sure to jump into the Telegram and the free Discord. So we're just taking a look at Polkadot here and as you can see, it does look as though Polkadot has been, you know, really smashed down recently, hasn't it? Let's no, make no mistake about it. Polkadot is a crypto that has been, you know, underperforming quite a decent amount, to be honest. You know, it's one of these blue chip altcoins that has been, you know, heavily beat down by the price action of Bitcoin, being quite heavily correlated to Bitcoin and Ethereum. It's obviously been suffering quite a lot over the, you know, the course of most of the bull run, to be honest. In a similar way to VeChain, which we cover a lot on the channel, it, it has been absolutely smashed down, hasn't it? You can see here it did actually make an all time high recently. In, you know, at the start of November here, where we came up to around that $55 mark. I think that was off the back of the hype, essentially for um, the uh, smart contracts and the uh, the auctions for the slots for Polkadot's ecosystem. And uh, as a result of that, for the Parachain launch, that's what it is. I couldn't remember it then. It was just floating around in my head. For the Parachain auction, and uh, we did see a lot of hype for this, but obviously as it started to progress, you can see throughout November as well, because of the massive uh, rollover we saw in the market, we did see a massive sell-off for Polkadot, where you saw basically we're heading down in a channel like this. You can see it quite clearly. We have marked it here from around that time where we hit the all-time high at $55. Ever since then, we had a very decent sell-off all the way, didn't we? You can see here we had a decent amount of structure in this area here, and you thought maybe, you know, we'd come up back test and then continue, but obviously on the 10th of November, we had that rollover pulled us back in and then ever since we've just been rolling over to the downside haven't we this 078 extension here lost the support and then once we lost that we seem to roll a massive i mean this is this is a crazy amount isn't it just melting through the fibonacci levels like butter here we come down through the 618 the 050 the 038 all the way down towards the 023 down there but we did wick all the way back up above the 618 here and you can see since then for Polkadot, we've kind of been trading sideways, haven't we? We've come obviously back up above the 618 on the daily, but we lost it, retested as resistance. We rolled over a little bit more. We've come down here, but we did get a decent pickup back up above these levels. And we got the breakout of the resistance, which is good to see. And we're seeing this pattern for quite a lot of cryptos. We've seen it for Phantom. We've seen it for um, uh, quite a few other ones that I can't remember off the top of my head, but it seems to be a common pattern at the minute that we're kind of getting the breakout and the back test of this channel, this downtrend we've been in ever since November really, which is obviously a good sign. And you can see here for Polkadot specifically, it's looking like we have basically come up, got stuck under the 55 EMA, come back down, retested the 618 as support, which is obviously bullish because, you know, we were starting to get stuck underneath this on the daily time frame, which isn't good at all. And you can see here, looking very good in our opinion. We've come back up above the 618, a very key level on that Fibonacci pull that we pulled obviously from the old previous all time high. At around what was it $49 down to that low that we saw at around $10 in you know July 2021 and you can see here obviously we've come back up got a back up above the 618 looking good and now over the past few days just having a little bit of a consolidation coming back up into you know basically we've formed a bit of a range haven't we you can see for Bitcoin doing something very similar and we think you know Polkadot's obviously mimicking what Bitcoin's doing quite closely highly correlated being as how it's a blue chip altcoin it has a lot of correlation to bitcoin in general for the most part anyway and you can see here obviously for the most part we are just putting in kind of a range looking something like this we retested the top of the range here come back to the middle which does seem to be this 618 level and beyond that you know not really that much not really that much going on with polka dot to be honest you can see we have got some bullish divergences here on the RSI and the histogram, when we're coming down, back down here, you can see probably most likely once we hit getting towards this uh, 050 Fibonacci level here that we probably get front run and get a bounce to the upside because let's be honest, it looks as though Polkadot has essentially, you know, it's done very well, hasn't it? We do think that 
despite you know all the bearishes that we have seen here that we do think the polka dot overall since the start of the year it's done pretty damn well hasn't it if you brought polka dot back here you'd still be up around what is this five or six x so in about a year's time at five or six x you know even though that doesn't seem like much in crypto terms this is still massively outperforming things like bitcoin which is only up you know what was it 60 percent on the year 70 percent on the year so obviously not ideal if you want to be making hundreds of x's but this is still a decent return and you know considering that polka dot in our opinion is a really quality project even though it has been underperforming somewhat people's expectations for this year the bull run is obviously seeming to be extended and we do think polka dot has got a lot more to come obviously with the launch of its ecosystem there's going to be a, a much higher demand for its um higher demand for its token once we see the TVL start to get locked in, as well as Cardano, to be honest, into the next year, hopefully, we'll see them both launch with a plom. Once their ecosystems start to get fleshed out, it's uh, we are hopeful that we are going to start to see some more upwards price action for these cryptos. Because to be honest, you know, right now, there's a lot of people that say, you know, these cryptos are pure speculation. There's no actual ecosystem that's backing them up. And, you know, there is an element of truth to that in that as much as you want to, you know, if you really like these projects, you don't want to admit it. But... You know, when you look at the facts, Cardano and Polkadot, they haven't actually got ecosystems yet. So you can't really value these tokens apart from pure speculation or in relation to other ecosystems. But as we've said, obviously made by top quality uh, developers from Ethereum. Um, so it's pretty obvious in our opinion that we do think that these these projects are definitely going to come good. And we do think Polkadot's probably one of them. Realistically, we do think Polkadot, you know, 100 200 300 dollars in the next year it seems quite likely in our opinion once the ecosystem does actually start to get fleshed out and actually put together so we'll keep things short and sweet then obviously polka dot here looking like it's breaking out back testing and then getting that continuation which is good to see if we roll over as we said to that 27 dollar ish area at the 618 would be good support and that swingler around 26 dollars here would be a decent support as well we think for continuation we could even see a back test of that previous resistance at around $23 if we got a rollover in the market of any big um, big size. But realistically, as we said, we want to be coming back up towards this $32, $32 level, which is basically the top of the range. And then getting the breakout towards that, what is this, the 078 at around $35. And then if we look at the Fibonacci here, you can see quite clearly that we've got some, you know, very decent price targets for Polkadot. We do think realistically, you know, once we break out of the all time high, which we think we probably will do over the next few months, We've got that 127 at around $75, but we did say $100 to $200 for Polkadot. In our opinion, you know, it's quite likely if we do see the market grow overall. So I'd like to thank everyone so much for their support. If you've got any questions or suggestions, please leave them down below and don't forget to subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon to stay up to date with four videos we post every single day. Remember, if you want to support the channel more directly and get a ton of benefits and insight, as well as joining our growing community, consider the Patreon or YouTube membership down below. There are three tiers giving you access to our private Discord. Crypto support is available if you just want to help us out a small amount. Crypto Maximalist is our main tier, which gives you access to detailed daily technical analysis and signals, weekly and monthly coin calls, and insights into our personal moves, while Maximalist Gold takes it a step further giving you an insight into our personal portfolio tracker, super low cap gem research, and a 100x portfolio we're constructing and updating, and access to us personally as a resource to discuss your portfolio via Messenger. Make sure to check it out. You can also sign up to our free Telegram and public Discord via the description as well. All the links are in the description for affiliate links for discounts and free crypto, so go check them all out below. There's plenty of goodness on offer. Please like and subscribe. We are... Crypto Maximus.